Now I'm going to show you some finishing touches for your customized lampshade. I'm going to warn you, no matter how careful you are when you cut out your template and you cut out your fabric, sometimes this is going to happen. You're going to see that there's a little bit excess fabric right here, and then there's a little bit here where you can still see the lampshade, but that's okay because we've got some tricks to cover that up. First of all, with this excess fabric, what you're going to want to do is cut that away. So we'll get our scissors and we will cut this excess fabric off. Now if you want a really professional edge, like a little hem on this, all you have to do is tuck it under. The spray adhesive should be enough to hold it into place, but if you find that it's still becoming a little bit loose, that's when your glue gun's going to come into play. You'll simply run a bead down the length of the shade, pressing down as you go. This is a super easy no-sew project. There, now we have our hem. We'll also cut off the excess fabric around the top and the bottom. And now for those pesky little spots where you can see the lampshade, that's what this trim is for. I've got a little bit of finished trim here and I've got a little bit of ball fringe here. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to line the edge with hot glue. This hot glue can get very, very hot. It's not a good idea to have kids around while you're doing this, but they do have a new version of low temp glue guns that really help a lot. We're going to put it on right there along the top, and then we'll just keep going. It also dries pretty fast, so you kind of want to put it on as you go. If you were to put the glue on all the way around first and then try to put the fringe on, it might be already cooled. And then we'll just snip off the excess. We're going to do the exact same thing on the bottom. The trim gives it a really nice custom decorator look, and no one's going to know that you really just put it on there to cover up your mistakes.